So here's our 2016 Chevy Silverado 3500 HD. So this is a Duramax truck. Of course, you get the uh, Allison transmission as well. This truck does have a salvage title actually due to right side damage. The core support here was pushed back a little bit, which pushed on the air cleaner, which popped it off the snorkel tube. So we got to check engine light because obviously it's not reading your mass airflow sensor correctly. As far as the frame damage goes, I do not see really any frame damage whatsoever other than this radiator support mount is pushed on just a little bit and the front bumper bracket is pushed back just a little bit up high. But there looks to be no damage around the frame whatsoever. Looks like there's no suspension damage. Now we haven't done anything to the truck whatsoever. It will need a fender. Our hood here looks fine. Door is fine. This door here has got a little damage here. Of course, we got a little damage here uh, down the cab corner. And then this box side, it was not ripped off. Um, you can see there's just a little bit of a damage here, but it was unbolted. Don't know where it is. A lot of the bits and pieces here are in the back of the truck still. Looks like we got the bumper, uh, our upper radiator, sight shield, mud flap, uh, fenders there, our front fender mud flap. There's a box of hardware up there. There's a rear bumper, it's got just a little bit of a dinger on it. Truck runs and drives just fine. If it wasn't for missing a tail light and the front air cleaner um, not being connected, I would say you could drive this truck anywhere just as it is. But without a brake light and a turn signal back there, you, you wouldn't be able to drive this truck on the highway as it is. Now this truck's currently got 110,000 miles on it. Start it up. In other words, everything else in the truck here seems to work just fine. Looks like it does have aftermarket heated seats. They're on both sides. Uh, somebody had that installed. Our uh, blower motor works just fine. Radio works just fine. As far as lights go on the dash, see we got the one check engine light here service emission system uh, that's I'm pretty sure that's gonna be because that's uh, disconnected we don't see any other damage whatsoever to any other mechanical parts to the truck whatsoever it is a four-wheel drive truck we have tested that four-wheel drive works just fine and shut our truck off I believe we have a window sticker here And I tell you about the truck, our window sticker original price was 54,265 miles. And here's all of our options. Looks like uh, 373 rear rear axle. Um, a lot of people want to know that. And uh, that's going to be all for our, our video for the day. As always, if you have any questions, I apologize for the focus on my camera here, but as always, if you have any questions, feel free to shoot us an email. Thank you very much and have a good day. Maybe go like that. Well, looks like our camera is not going to refocus for you. There we go.